Well, my name is Nick Panunzio, and I'm an assistant professor in the Department of Medicine Division of Hematology Oncology. Uh, I started my lab here at UCI in July of 2019. Uh, so the overall aspects of science that I've really always been interested in is DNA instability and DNA repair. I've always just been very fascinated by the fact that, you know, these small little molecules in, in our bodies are what code for uh, everything to make us who we are. Um, and what's even more fascinating is when these uh, DNA becomes damaged, uh, that can lead to mutations, that can lead to certain diseases. And so I've always been really fascinated by some of these really genome-wide types of rearrangements that occur, particularly chromosomal translocations, uh, where you have DNA break and chromosome arms rejoin uh, in different uh, aberrant formations, and how that can lead to cancer. And so a lot of our research right now is focused on understanding the mechanisms of these genome rearrangements and why certain populations more, may be at more high risk uh, for certain types of cancer because of that. I think making a difference is always like the key behind uh, a lot of cancer research, right? Uh, and I feel like where we've really been able to shine in that is focusing on cancer health disparities. Um, and so in particular, a major driving force in our lab is to address the catchment area of the Child Family Comprehensive Cancer Center and the large uh, Hispanic and Latinx population we have here. And so one of our major goals is to understanding why this population is more at risk for certain types of cancers um, and able to study that as well. And, and even going beyond the research, we really want to have a big impact in the community uh, by going out and giving community lectures, getting people to know about our research and the risks that could be associated with different types of cancers as well. I think there's a lot of unknown to a lot of donors about the process of getting funding in labs. Um, even if you're associated with the university as great as UCI, uh, that doesn't mean that the funding for the labs are guaranteed. And essentially, we're almost private contractors, so we have to go out and seek the money ourselves. Um, and of course, like a lot of the big money is from federal government uh, grants uh, that can fund a lab long term. Uh, but it turns out that a lot of those grant mechanisms don't like to just fund something that's very high risk. Um, you have to have a lot of preliminary data before you can apply for those grants. And that's really where private foundation money is so critical to our research. Uh, that provides the funding for the high risk, high reward type of uh, experiments that we can do to generate uh, preliminary data to lead to these larger grants that can fund the lab more long term. Uh, and so getting people that really care about the community and about cancer treatment um, and different types of cancer risks is, is totally important to, to our mission in order to study these different types of cancers.